Yeah, we're very excited to have our friends from Gonzales ISD down visiting our aviation program. So we had some of their board members, their superintendents, some of their staff here to learn from us. And it's just exciting to share because in education, it's about sharing ideas. We can learn from other districts and they can learn from us. So it was nice just to be able to share our best practices specifically around the aviation program. So very proud of our team, very proud of our students and just proud of the district and our community for leaning forward and creating this aviation program and giving our students opportunities that uh, are going to set them up for success in the future. So McAllen all over the state is known for its innovation, its great programs. Today specifically we're here for the aviation program. We heard about it, we saw uh, some visuals about it, and we just had to come and check out that amazing program in y'all's district. And under uh, Dr. Gonzalez's leadership, um, we knew it was going to be a stellar program to look at. That's something that we want to bring to our district uh, and make it uh, available for our students. My kind of Fight Academy came about on December the 12th of 2010, so we've been a Fight Academy for 13 years. What is very amazing to me is that the enthusiasm of the students, also how much of their, of, of their time and their effort they put into the program. As an instructor, as a, as a business owner, as a pilot, it really gratifies me to know that I am able to contribute to the younger generations, the ones that are coming behind us. One of the challenges I had was I'm in a lot of stuff, so football, wrestling, handling school, and aviation. So after school practicing for wrestling, marching band too, so I was in a lot of stuff. Me and a friend of mine, Rohan, uh, we're gonna go to IFR, the next level, and during the summer. And hopefully by December, I'll get my commercials and then start before I went 21. So they definitely asked like preemptively, like what was the coolest part, what are some challenges we're facing, and I told them, the coolest part, we're flying planes, it's so cool. Um, one of the challenges I think that we're all facing is specifically just balancing the fact that we have to fly the planes and we have to get our hours on our own time. So we have to balance extracurriculers and work and family time and all that. So we have to fly on the weekends and after school. Oh, so I've always wanted to be a commercial pilot. I always have. I used to live right next to an airport, so I had planes overhead all the time. My dad was also super enthusiastic about planes. I've always wanted to be around them. And so just having the opportunity to fly planes in the first place is an incredible opportunity for me. The superintendent, he asked me like what I want to go into when I'm older, and I said aerospace engineering. That's one of the main reasons I joined this class because those are two these are two fields that correlate very well together. It's thrilling, it's amazing that now I can say that I've helped control a plane, that I flew a plane. It's definitely very scary, but it's, it's, it's just awe-inspiring and such an amazing experience. To other students, I would say definitely jump on it because you're not, you're not gonna get an opportunity like this. I mean, it's... This, this was a gift. It, it fell into our lap, so of course we jumped on it. Um, definitely make sure if you're going to go into this though that you take it seriously, because it's not a guarantee. Even if you go into the program, you still have to put in the time, you have to put in the effort so that you can actually be focused and get in all of the necessary hours and really just put in the work. But when you do it, it's rewarding. There's nothing like it.